Okay, so I am going on another date with Matt, trying to persuade him once again to stay with me instead of going off dating all these other women, but you probably know how this one's gonna end up. A man can hope and a man can dream. Matt loves movies. Matt loves going to movie theaters. Matt literally skips work sometimes and just goes to the movie at 12 o'clock in the afternoon. We are going to a drive-in movie theater where you're teaming up with Babe Wines and we are teaming up with the Miami Dolphins. So we are taking a car, going down to the Hard Rock and we are going to hang out, watch a drive-in movie and have a wonderful, beautiful date. Maybe you guys can take this idea, myself already, and, and go check out the Dolphin Stadium and go watch one of your favorite movies. Tonight we're watching A Field of Dreams. So, time for me to get ready. I'm nervous. All my good clothes are in New York City. I don't know what I'm gonna do. <sighs> yep, that's it right there. You are a mountain. You are a tall tree. You are a swift wind. You are strong. You are beautiful. You are gonna be by yourself soon because Matt's gonna get a new girlfriend hey no no that, that's not the attitude you can have on these dates man come on it's okay maybe I'll find a girlfriend soon and Matt's 10 minutes late once again Matt's late you know Brad Paisley did a song waiting on a woman more like waiting on Matt. You know, whoever gets Matt, you know what, you're always gonna be late. Get used to it. Do you think it's gonna be a good date? It's gonna be a great date. Katie's our, our third wheel today. Are you nervous? Not really nervous yet, but I think as I get to the stadium, I'll get those pregame jitters. Yeah. You know? All right. Our man is here. Splash. Sorry I'm late. It's all right. Pretty used to it by now. <laughs> but uh, I have to say, one of us dressed up for this date, and one of us, it looks like they're going to go chill. You know, comfort. Uh, Do you have to be comfortable watching a movie? Is that what? Comfort's key. I'm probably going to fall asleep, so I want to be in something comfortable when I sleep. I'm going to fall asleep on my date. That's sick. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Matthew awesome. James. Yes, sir. You are a big movie guy. I love movies. You love favorite genre? Favorite genre, uh, Pixar. 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 I don't know, it's a genre now. Yeah, okay. Pixar is a genre now. 2020, love cartoon type movies. Like Up, Up's a great movie. That's a cop out though. How to Train Your Dragon is my favorite movie of all time. The third one. Second okay. one's really good too though. I fall asleep to movies. So like when I go to bed, I'll and the other night I found you in my bed watching that. And was it Pets? Pets? <laughs> Secret Life of Pets Secret too. Secret Life of Pets too. I was like, just got here. <laughs> oh man. It's therapeutic. It helps me fall asleep. How many movies have made you cry? Um, two. Two? What movies are those? Best Man Holiday. Oh, I cried in that one too. Yep. And, um... Um, Guardians of the Galaxy. Those, so you only cried in two movies? I only cried in two movies. Yeah, I gotta put you on some more emotional movies, man. Those are emotional when Groot yeah. gave his life for his squad. Nice. Like, that was Groot crazy. is a tree. Groot gave you his life. a tree. Yeah, but he gave his a life tree. for it. Nice. Groot gave his no, life for his terrible. squad. And terrible. like, that act of selflessness like brought tears in my eyes. Yeah, it's a great movie. Funniest movie you ever watched? I can think any movie's funny if I'm like in a silly mood, but any of the rush hours. Like, yeah. I think Chris Tucker is like one of the funniest. Like, anything with Chris Tucker, any old school uh, Chris Rock, like, any of like those comedians in those movies. So what about horror films? Do you watch any horror films? Ah, uh, I don't do horror films. I, I do a thriller, like, uh, the, the scariest I'll go is like a Disturbia with Shia LaBeouf. Like, any like, demonic, like, like I can't do that stuff. Like, I have nightmares, yeah. I can't. Favorite actor or favorite actress? Favorite actor? Favorite actor is easy, Denzel. Denzel. I'll watch anything with Denzel in it. Actress? Uh, Rooney Mara. What the hell is that? Rooney Mara is my celebrity crush. Really? Yes. That was gonna be my next question. Is there an actress that's like your celebrity Yeah, crush? Rooney Mara, bro. You have to look her up. Yeah, you have to look her up. All right, Matt. 
you turn the camera to the right, this is not only where <laughs> that's <a> bridge. <laughs> <laughs> but if you look, that's the Hard Rock wow. Stadium right there. That is where I, me and you got beat by Miami one year. We got crushed. That's where, you know, we've talked about movies. Yep. We are on our way to go into the stadium this time, not to watch a football game, but to do a drive-in movie theater experience. Ooh. So they have these okay. massive, they have these massive screens for us to pull up to, uh, social distance, and watch, you know, a movie together. Damn, stoked. I figured, you know, it'd be a nice way for us to have like a little romantic time together. I've never been to a drive-in movie. It's my first drive-in movie theater as well. So I'm excited, and uh, what better way to do it than to do it with the, the you know the only team to ever have an undefeated you know <laughs> Super Bowl season, the Miami Dolphins, the greatest team ever to play oh, football, boy. the 1972 Miami Dolphins. Wow. Uh, so we are at the home of the greatest football team ever. Wow, I didn't realize that. Yep. All right, so we are here at the Dolphins Stadium. We are excited to get on with our drive-in movie theater date we are transitioning from this car to our special babe car because we are here with babe wines and the miami dolphins i'm stoked about this so we're gonna mask up social distance and go in and have ourselves a little move a little movie date so i'll see y'all in a little bit I'll be back. <laughs> I'll be back with the plus one. Oh man. <laughs> Does that mean I have to get a plus one soon? Yeah, you do. Are we going to double date? Yeah. Oh. Uh oh. We got some jerseys. Oh, this is you right here. Me? Wow. Damn. Yo, these are hard. They got our old numbers back. <laughs> Two and three. Two and three, baby. A real MJ. Uh, I'm ready for football season now. <laughs> yeah. Put me in, coach. <laughs> we got some popcorn. Come on. Yeah, I thought it was high. Ready? Yeah. Ah! And that's why he got cut. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get one. Oh my god. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> hey, yo, yo, yo. Lock, in. Lock in. What was that? Seven, two, one. We got one, two, three, four, five, six. Two, Does that four, say something? Six, seventh try. You is that the about? One. Is that the QB or is that the receiver? What about seventh one? That's the seventh one. I'm just, I'm just curious. I'm just All right, you ready? One. Wow. What a great, what a great toss. I'm good, I'm good with my mouth. What a great toss. What a great job. <laughs> I don't know if it's because I'm starving, but this popcorn is incredible. This popcorn is delicious. <laughs> <laughs> jerseys on we're here at the hard rock having a wonderful time at the stadium uh excited for this movie but chris i can't watch this damn movie if you're in the way so i need you to get out chris chris all right all right chris go i'm out, I'm out of here What are the odds you jump in that water fountain? One to five. Three, two, one, two. Four. Damn it. Now you gotta do it. I'll do one through I'll do one through two. One through two? Yeah. Alright. Three, two, one, one. 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 <laughs> you gotta do it. No, you gotta do it. That was for you. <laughs> that was for you. This is what Matt does every time. Go hop in. No way. No way. 
Oh, you can't stop. That was weak as hell. I was hoping for like a little dive. It was warm though, wasn't it? It was good. All right, date is a wrap. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta control your date. I know. He's out of whack. Good luck to whoever ends up with this man. You got a lot on your hands, let me tell you. All right, so that's a wrap for the night. Uh, amazing night here at the Hard Rock Stadium, home of the Miami Dolphins. Much love to them, much love to Bay for taking us out, showing us a good time, supplying us with drinks, uh, supplying us with jerseys. Uh, very grateful, um, but great night, great drinks, great friends, great company. So we are headed out, another great date with Matt. I think he's still gonna take going on dating other girls instead of taking me, but uh, <laughs> you know, it is what it is. It is what it is, yeah. Hey, come here often? If so, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and get ready to watch my next video. I hope you enjoyed it, because I love having fun with you.